This has been a dream of mine for several years and maybe even decades to have Diane Bish here at our church. And the Lord just seemed to work it out on this particular Father's Day night. Diane Bish has displayed her dazzling virtuosity and unique showmanship the world over. Critics have hailed her performances as stunning, virtuoso, fiery, and astonishing. Through numerous recordings, concerts, and weekly television appearances, Diane Bish is the most visible organist in the world today, and that's true. Miss Bish is best known as the host of the international television series, The Joy of Music. The program is available to over 300 million viewers weekly and features Miss Bish playing famous organs in solo and with other classical musicians in cathedrals, churches, and concert halls around the world. She was for 20 years the organist at uh, Dr. James Kennedy's church at the Coral Ridge Presbyterian Church in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. May I introduce to you now, and would you help me welcome Miss Diane Bish. I'd like to welcome each of you here this evening. It's a great joy for me to be here in this great church that I have heard of for so many years. It's also a great honor for me to have the choir perform with me Friday night and uh, yesterday morning we recorded some wonderful music and we would like to begin the program tonight with a great statement of faith, Christ the Lord is risen today. And this is the uh, message of this concert, and I know all of the music that takes place in this church.
Well, I would like to play for you now a melody which you all know, the Caroline of Westminster. It begins with the melody in the left hand, then goes to the right hand. Then I begin to add sounds and stops, so I play the melody with the feet. Then I begin to add more sounds and stops till at the end of the piece, we have full organ and the melody is played in both hands and pedal.
Uh, for over 20 years, I was the organist and artist in residence at the Coral Ridge Presbyterian Church in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. The first Sunday I played at this great church, I played two services. Then I went outside afterward, and uh, you know the signboards they have in front of churches? I looked at it, and it read, services 9, 15, and 11. The sermon, what is hell like? Come hear our new church organist. I stayed at the church anyway, <laughs> and one of the things that I love to do there and continue to love to do is to write arrangements of hymns because they help me express my personal faith in Jesus Christ. I'm sure there's not one of you here tonight that doesn't have a favorite hymn that you've loved since childhood or come to love, that the words and the music bring you hope and encouragement, and we all need that.
I thank each of you for coming this evening. I do realize that this uh, takes the place of the evening service here at the church, and I pray that uh, this organ will always be used both in concert and worship to praise the Lord and bring glory to his name. It's a wonderful organ, and I congratulate you uh, in this church on having it. And I also want to thank the choir and the orchestra for joining me tonight. like to purchase today's program or any program in our library of over 400 videos and CDs from the great organs and historic churches of the world, please call 1-800-933-4844. We hope to hear from you.